Welcome one and all to 64. My name is Deep Space Matt, and today I expand my operation with a new factory floor to try and keep up with the rising cost of progress. And with the void now accessible on demand, I can start fueling the upgrades necessary to get to the next phase. What happens when I finally complete my research on the mysterious rock? Let's find out in 64. All right, here we go with some more 64. And our factory has now broke into presumably a parallel universe. So let's take a look at what our next steps are and continue. First things first, we got to make sure all of our silos are fueled up. We want to run our oxidizers. We want to run this. We don't even have enough resources to run the reactor. But we do want to make sure our irradiators are going. And then, oh, take a look. Do we have any new texts? We do not. That's all the same. And then we have the reconstructed hollow over here. It dramatically increases hollow stone spawn rate and does everything silently. That sounds great. I'm guessing that means we're not going to get those big yellow flashes anymore. We do need 128 hollow stones, which we are almost there. And we need 2k each of void and reality. And then we also have all the way down here at the bottom, I believe, the hollow fruit, a hollow flower evolution prevents the formation of hollow stones to nourish itself and produces hollow stones. We can build one of these right now, but it does use 256 void and 512 reality. I might want to just save up for the reconstructed hollow first, which means we should go into the void right now. Oh, get these loaded. At least I presume over here, I presume this is the void where we collect reality. And the only way to collect more reality is just to wait for this to regenerate itself. And it looks like every single machine that we make creates some sort of, I guess you'd call it like echo here in the void. So I wonder if it's worth it to create a bunch of very cheap machines just to be able to collect more reality. Can I use the waypoint here? Is this the waypoint? Uh, is this the waypoint? Doesn't look like we can. So we got to zoom on out. Oh, grab that. There we go. And come up here to our hollow rock. So we can grab these. It's very interesting. It looks like the hollow rock and all the little hollow stones it makes. I presume these small ones are hollow stones. It looks like they also create holes through the universe here into the void. All right, let's go back down. And are these ready to harvest again? They are not. Let's just go back to reality then. Make sure everything's running quite nicely. Oh man, and it takes a while for our, for our eyes to readjust being back here. Load this. Oh, well, how much Karenite do we have? We have 16 million Karenite. Maybe we don't need to run run our oxidizers at the moment and build up some of our beta pylene instead since they use a bunch of beta pylene. Oh, load this up. All right, we are there with the hollow stones. We just need more void. Uh, which we're slowly getting there. I think that I just grabbed some more void coming out of the ground. Or that might have been Karenite. I'm not quite sure. Oh, load this. Can we build another Annihilator? I'm sure we're going to need void for other things as well. Oh, we, we can? Oh, wait, if we can grab it before the... Uh, come on, grab it before the Hell Gems destroy themselves. Or get destroyed. There we go. Got it. Oh no, wait, what a minute. What happened to our hollow stones? Wait, what's using hollow stones? I mean, the annihilators use hollow stones, but it requires a hollow stone. So it's only using one. One per cycle. Where did all the rest go? Okay, I'm going to hold off on our oxidizers right now. 
Arkham went down so much. Um, I'm not sure. Do the Void Resonators use Hollow Stones? I didn't think they do. I don't remember what else uses Hollow Stones. Refineries. Oh, maybe the Irradiators do? I'm not sure. I can't tell until they're done. Which if I... Hold on, let's take one. Take this, move it. No, you don't. You just use a chromolite and Celestial Foam. Okay, we can put you back. Alright, well, we're going to have to... Collect a bunch more. Oh, we should go back into the void. Got to keep remembering to do this. At least we don't have anything yet that eats reality. So I don't have to worry about that. And it looks like one more trip here into the void and we'll have enough for the reconstructed hollow. All right, back out here. Make sure our factory floor is still running. Yeah, we're going down in hollow stones. That's not good. Because we have the void now. We're about to have the reality. And if we go up here... Yeah, look at all these. There's not quite enough here to grab to get us back up. Maybe... We need these hollow fruits. Prevents the formation of hollow stones to nourish itself. Produces hollow stones. Which doesn't make much sense. It stops hollow stones, but then it makes hollow stones. How does that work? But then if we do the reconstructed hollow, it increases hollow stone spawn rate. But if we have the fruit... The hollow stones aren't being made. So why would we want both of these? Uh, oh, grab this. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, no, I think I got it. Okay, so it prevents the formation of hollow stones. So it stops these little guys from coming up out of the ground. And it eats it. But when it produces hollow stones, I'm guessing it produces it and it just drops those hollow stones directly into our... I want to say this is our inventory up here. So it's stopping the hollow stones from coming out. It's eating them and giving us hollow stones. And then the reconstructed hollow will just make that happen much faster. Okay, I think we need to do the hollow fruits, actually. Let's plop one here. See what it does. It's got a, a timer on it. But it's not moving. Why is it not moving? Oh. Oh, because it only happens when... When a hollow stone tries to come out of the ground. So we just have to wait. Alright, well... We'll let that run. Come back down here. See what we gotta do. What else can we make? I don't think we need more annihilators. At least not for the moment. Silos. We do need a couple more preheaters here. But we need 93 celestial foam. Which we're actually going to get soon. Oh, but 1.4 million in the beta pilings. So we might have to run this reactor. Let's run the reactor for, you, for a few cycles. Uh, we're not going to run the oxidizers and build up our beta piling back. And, oh yeah, Void Resonators. We want to replace all of our Resonator 2s with Void Resonators. And I think that's pretty much it. Oh, and Hell Vault. Probably need another Hell Vault. We have two already. But we need, we need another 9 million Beta Pylene and 1 million of the Foam. Oh, how are we going to get 1 million of the Foam? These Irradiators... They use like 8k foam a pop. The reactor uses a lot too. 
we're just not digging fast enough. I wonder if we make another another extracting channel. That might help. And I think we should be able to afford it at this stage. Yeah, maybe we do that. If we put one like right here and we just move our reactor set up. Or maybe we put it over here and just move these guys. Oh, there was another hollow stone. Let's go take a look. Oh, look at that. Oh. And then it popped. Did that give us hollow stone? Oh, it did on the chart. We got a big bump in hollow stone. I don't know how much it gave us. But interesting, it didn't... It didn't stop this hollow stone here. So it looks like there's a certain area of effect that it's stopping. So we might want to build more around it. Let's just grab this. Let's put another flower over here. Or not flower, put a fruit on a flower. And then perhaps this one here. And we're going to need to grab a whole bunch more reality. Should be ready by now. And we'll see if three hollow fruits are enough to be getting us into the positive of hollow stone generation. Oh, I heard, I heard a silo go out here in the void. That's very interesting. Everything's so quiet, but I can still hear that. Oh, wait a minute. Can we not go back out? <gasps> we can't go back out. Oh, is this thing not big enough? Oh, do we not have enough reality? Oh, no, we're stuck here in the void. <laughs> I've, I've stuck myself in the void. I didn't even know that's how it works. Yeah, because this thing was a lot bigger. And then when we collect the reality, it, it, it pops into this into this hole through the universe but it looks like we need enough in order to power the portal all right well let's go up to our our hollow stone or hollow rock grab what we have over there since we're stuck here anyway i wonder if there's anything else around here in the void like if we go straight down Anything down here? Any more hollow rocks? There's nothing down here. I'm, I'm, I'm pressing down for quite a while. Going back up. At least I think I'm going back up. Oh yeah, there we go. Are these ready yet? No. Anything over here? I don't know what I keep moving around expecting to find. I've already done this a couple of times. I'm just kind of trying to kill time. Is that enough? Oh, there, that's enough. We might as well grab all of this while we can. Oh, I should be zoomed out when I'm collecting all this. Much faster. All right, now we can return to reality, thankfully. Oh, and all, look at this, all our... All of our uh, silos are, are done for. Okay, we're at 3 million beta piling. We're doing well on that front. We are at 67 hollow stone. I think we were at 70 something. Let's take a look. Are these guys... Are these hollow fruits going or can we only have one hollow fruit at a time? This one's working. And these ones don't seem to be. Maybe I just need to wait. Alright, let's go back. We're going to take a look elsewhere, but we, we want another extracting channel. So let's put it right over here. Let's move all this stuff over here about. I'll make it look nice later. And if we want another extracting channel, how much spaces do we have between these two? One, two, three, four. There's five. Let's 
we want one, two, three, four, five. No, wait a minute. One, two, three, four, five spaces in between, so we want it there. And excavating channel, and then we want injectors on the corners. And then if we're rotated 90 degrees compared to this one, our original factory, we want it to match this one here, which means we want the valve on this side, auxiliary pump, pump station, and the rest are going to be coolers there with their upgrades. Uh, keep this loaded. Keep this loaded. And, and then what? We have that here. Oh, we need a silo here and here. And then we need refineries on the corners. Here and there, there and there. Keep those loaded. Are these loaded? We're doing good. And is that it? Is that it for this central part? I think it is. So we can get these running. There we go. Oh, look at how fast that goes. Wow. Uh, and then we need to get a bunch of our resonators all the way around. Oh, grab that. So it's going to be resonators, then destabilizers in the center. So we're going... Wait a minute. What am I looking at here? So, resonator, resonator, destabilizer, resonator, resonator, and resonator, destabilizer there, resonators, like that, and where's our destabilizers, there, there, and there, up to industrial, up to hell gem destabilizers, and then we need we need a silos on the corners, right? Silos on the corners. Yeah, because there's nothing popping that, and we need one here. There we go. And we need to upgrade the resonators to be. What do these look like here? Oh wait. Uh, get off of that. Get off, get, get off of this resonator. We gotta load these silos. So we have... Resonator 2 is here and here. There and there. There and there. And... Oh! Oh, we're out of resources. What are we missing? Oh, we're missing Karenite. Okay. Uh, I guess we gotta run these now. And, and then we'll be pretty much almost set up once we get these purple resonators here, the regular resonators, to become capacitors. We can do one right now. And we'll have this all set up. That was a lot easier than expected. And then once we get to the celestial foam area, we can, I guess, increase our celestial foam generation. Um, let's move all this stuff down here. Just make it look kind of nice. Does that look nice? Maybe. Uh, no, uh, get out of that. I don't want that. Okay. Uh, what are we looking at? Uh, keep this running. Oh, go back to the void. Oh, zoom out to collect this. That's right. Oh, look at that. Our new factory floor. We can get some more lovely reality off of it. We gotta take a look at the hollow stones. Are we are we gaining on hollow stones? 
Where are we at? We're at 85. We we seem to be slowly gaining on hollow stones. But that's fine. We still need a bunch more reality. Uh, but let's take a look. Okay, so these ones, these ones are going. It just happened to be when we came to look, they they hadn't eaten yet. So 83 went up to 94. So we got like 11 out of that. So that's not bad. I think we're good. Although, we're not generating any more hollow stones around any of these guys. So like, I don't know if I want to turn this into a hollow fruit. Because I'm guessing this hollow fruit is going to be eating anything in its vicinity. Which means this, this one won't get to eat. What I need is... A hollow rock like up here. All right, uh, head back down. Refill all of this. Refill these. How are we looking at getting the capacitors going? Looking not too bad. All right, only only one more. And then I also, man, I want to upgrade these silos to the industrial silo. And just so I'm not clicking on them so much. How are we looking at over here? Load that. Okay, here goes our last capacitor. And there we go. I think that is complete. Oh no, wait a minute. I was wrong. We have, we have one down here too. Oh, we have, like, tons of void. We can probably... Wait, let's go to our annihilators. We can move our annihilators. Mo uh, come over here and buy our chancel. And that way we're not using as much hollow stones here. Keep running these. We can get this last capacitor, one million. And there we go. And that is all set. Excellent. We got three, three channels going. And then how much... How much does these industrial silos cost? Oh, it's more... It's more Karenite. Of course it is. I even feel like making more... <laughs> making more oxidizers here. Because we are... We're generating enough beta pylene. It looks like to run all the oxidizers we have. We can make another setup down here. Oh, go back into the void. Collect. Oh, look at this. Oh, that's because we put the we put the annihilators right next to the chancel. That's right. I like how our, our factory floor now looks like a heart <laughs> right there. Because we love this game. Grab all of this. All right, there we go. Maybe two more trips into the void, and we'll have enough. Uh, we have enough for a silo upgrade. Which one do we want to upgrade? Which one? This one's already upgraded. Let's go this one here. We can almost get another one. Oh, there's another one. Okay, um, maybe this one. 
Oh, and the preheaters. How much do we need? 1.49 Karenite and 1.49 of the Beta Pylene. Which we're almost there. But then again, once these go out, they're going to eat all my Beta Pylene. So let's hold off real quick. See if we can get another preheater going. Uh, we do want to run this. Something else went out. I think it was this that went out. Oh, wait, wait. Do we have enough? We have enough hollow stone. Okay, so our hollow stone generation is moving slowly. So now it's just here in the void. Are we ready again? We are ready again. Let's zoom back out. I'm betting this reconstructed hollow is going to open up whatever new buildings or new machines are for the next step. Is this enough? This is not enough. Just short. Okay, we're at 1600. Now we're at 1900. So definitely just one more, one more trip. Alright, come back down here. We were looking at the catalytic preheater for our irradiators here. We're almost there on the beta pylene. Wait, this doesn't use anything we need for the reconstructed hollow, does it? No, I mean it uses the the hell gems, but we'll get those back fairly quickly. Alright, come on, almost there. 0.44, 0.38. It's going, it's going up and down. It's teasing me. The game is teasing me now. It's stuck at 1.44. Oh, oh, 0 0.5, 0 0.7. Oh, there we go. We almost had it for a second. There it is. Grab it. Pop it down. Oh, we can't afford to run it. And there it goes. Excellent. Alright, who's out? You're out. You're out. These guys, man, we might want to run them again for more Karenite. Uh, yeah, let's build our Karenite back up. And let's go back to the void. And this should be the last time. Well, the last time for now. Until we need it for something else. Alright, excellent. Alright, let's build this reconstructed hollow waypoint. Oh, look at that. Oh, interesting. Interesting, we can offset it a little. But no, we want it right here. Oh, wow. Oh, we have no texts. It's not a rock, it's a lens. A lens? It can make everything converge into a single point. And I mean everything. Space, time, all the concepts and rules, everything. How do I know this? I guess from all the research. Did you find that? <laughs> Did you find the manual or something? I don't know why it's there and why we, we're here. I just somehow know what it does now. So are you going to converge everything or what? I mean, that sounds like a bad idea. Or is that like... Is that like the Big Bang, the beginning of the universe? I don't know how, but maybe it's the point of this place. Now it just floats up in the air as if that's what it's supposed to do. And what happens next? No idea. I mean, I build more stuff. I have something new here. The inverse chasm, a bridge to the unknown. Holy cow, 20 million. 20 million. I'm not even close on anything for that. 
So 20 million for the first four here. 4k hell gems. So we're definitely going to need some more hell vaults. 20k chromolites. That's no problem. 2 million celestial foam. That could be an issue. 2,000 hollow stones. Also an issue. 2,000 void. 2,000 reality. Or 4,000 reality. Those are not issues. Uh, interesting. This is here. I thought this was supposed to eat it. Oh, maybe it eats it once. Never mind. We can upgrade these. Okay, now I got it. So when... When one of these hollow stones are generated, the hollow fruit eats it, but then it's not eating anymore. Then it's just growing. And then it's going to eat another one that gets made after it's grown. So we can build a whole bunch more hollow fruits because we need 2,000. We need 2,000. Oh, we can't build it because we don't have enough reality. We need to go back down, grab some reality. Let's get rid of this one. We can build another fruit there. All right, come here. Oh wait, hold on. We gotta reload silos, I'm sure. Since we got distracted by story. There we go. Uh, we now have 11 million Karenite. We need to get up to 20. Right, it was 20 Karenite. Yeah, 20 for the first four. Karenite, Elmarine, Canatite, and Beta Pylene. Uh, run this. Come back here. I wish there was a button where we could just press it and it would put the max zoom out. That would be great. Yeah, maybe we just find a bunch of cheap, cheap machines. I don't know, vats or sumps. And then, wait, why can't I go back? Why can't I go back? Oh, we don't have enough again. <laughs> I don't know how much it is that we need, but 478 is not doing it. It is larger than it was before when we were when we got stuck here. Let's go back up to our rock. Interesting. We had a reality here pop up, but we have no machine over here. I'm guessing we just get random reality. Oh, there it is. Oh, wait a minute. 1790? How do we get 1790? Was that the stuff up here? Oh, 1798. That one gave us eight. Do these give us more? Oh, different machines give us different amounts? Okay, maybe it is worth it to go up to the rock then. Uh, keep these guys running here. All right, anything else nude? I didn't even take a look here. Uh, does not look like it. But we do want more hollow fruits. Definitely. So let's... Oh, man, yeah, look at all these guys. It's really making tons of them. It's just popping up everywhere. Okay, this can be a hollow fruit. And... We'll make this one a hollow fruit. That's too close to our waypoint. I want them spread out a little bit. For no other reason than aesthetics. Oh, grab that. All right, excellent. Come back down here. Um, what do we need? Beta pylene. Let's get all our Karenite up. Man, we need to be able to build in the void and make a machine that'll just gather reality. So what is going to be the toughest thing here? I think the toughest thing is probably going to get be the 2 million celestial foam. We're just using so much of it. We're going to have to like stop our irradiators from running. And then build that up. Oh, but we need hell vaults. That right. That's right. Never mind. The next step is we need at least two more hell vaults. Because we need 4K. So we need to insulate 
4K Hell Gems. And we need, man, we need that 1 million Celestial Foam. But the issue is, our best source of Beta Pylene to get this 9 million for the Hell Vault is from these Irradiators, and they're the ones that are using all our Celestial Foam. So I think we want to... I think we want to get the the beta pylene first and then stop our irradiators and then get our celestial foam up and then make another hell vault and i can't imagine what the next one is going to be after that so let's stop our oxidizers once these silos go out so they're not using beta pylene Uh, our extracting channel here at 8k, not quite to the Celestial Foam section yet. We're at 43,000 on our main channel, 35,000 on our second channel. Looking good. I guess, I guess we should be running the reactor, right? It makes a ton of beta pylene. Should I make another reactor, too? Maybe. It's all about having this sort of balance between which machines you're running. There might be a balance where we're able to run all the machines constantly, but I haven't found that yet. It always seems we're too high on something and too low on something else. But we're getting our beta piling up, so that's good. This gave us... That gave us a lot. It gave us a little boost. I think we might need multiple reactors. We just don't have the foam. Run all these. We do want uh, another preheater right here. How much does that cost? Oh, 102,000 for the foam. We have everything else. So maybe we don't load this. Let's see, industrial silo. Yeah, I can use this. It's no problem. We have plenty of Karenite at the moment. And also these void... These void resonators. I probably should be... Upgrading to them, right? 27,000 on foam. I mean, I'm presuming they're going faster. It's always hard to tell. But I would probably want them here. Oh, wait a minute. Is this not correct? This is not correct here. We get. We need to... Yeah, we need to swap some of these around. This should be here, and that should be there. There we go. Or no, yeah. So that it works on this side that we have this middle block being hit by both a resonator and a capacitor. All right, is that an issue anywhere else? No, we have this side set up correctly. All right, where are we at everything? Still using way too much celestial foam. Because we're still running the reactor. Which doesn't, I mean, the reactor doesn't seem great at getting us beta pylene. It just went off, and it didn't seem like we went up a lot. But I want to get this other preheater. And 
and then we can worry about the Hell Vault. Uh, you're out. Let's get you going. Oh, you're out as well. Man, I wonder if we can even make another extracting channel here. Oh, we're going slow down. Oh, no, we're, we're speeding up. Yes, speed up. Oh, it's excellent. Look at that, 90. Oh, there we go. Preheater. Grab it quick. Plop. Oh, no, I lost it. There, go. All right, uh, let's go back to running these, I suppose. And then head back up here. Do I need... Oh, my, <laughs> look at all these. When it said it increases the spawn rate, it really increases the spawn rate. Okay, how many hollow stones? We needed 2,000. So, hollow fruit. Oh, we need more reality. That's the issue here. Okay, back into the void. And, okay, we have 366. Let's go up to the hollow, the hollow rock and see how much we grab out of this. Oh, 494. Oh, wow. Okay, those are the fruits. Okay, the fruits give a whole lot. So we definitely want more fruits because these guys, they give like one, maybe one, 1113. 11, 15, or maybe two. That one gave four. Varying amounts, but definitely the fruits give a whole bunch. So when I said earlier it's not worth it to zoom out and be going all the way up to the hollow rock, it is absolutely worth it now. And we need to build more fruits just so we can get reality faster. Okay, oh wait, we're stopped here. Load those, load these. Uh, load this. Man, getting up to one million. That's gonna take a while, I feel. We're at 10k now. Let's come up here. Let's place some more fruit. You're a fruit. Oh, never mind. But we can place a flower on you. Flower on that one. Get rid of those. All right, we're just we're just humming along here, waiting for this extracting channel to get low enough to be grabbing some more foam, and see if we can get a lovely bit of an increase in that. But we might might need to make another factory floor. And do I need to I don't need to run the annihilators. But then again, since we're making so much hollow stone now, we might as well. Are these considered conversion machines, the annihilators? They're not, because they're not with the other conversion machines. All right, uh, grab a silo upgrade there. And this one. Oh, there we go. If I can click in the right spot. And avoid resonators 
27k. I don't know if void resonators are a high priority. So I can't really tell if like these are these blocks here are going faster than these blocks over here that don't have void resonators. It all <laughs> at this speed it all seems the same. I can only presume since it's an upgrade that it will be faster. All right, how are we looking everywhere? We're almost at the 9 million for the Hell Vault. The only question is, once we turn off the irradiators and we stop making chromolite to decay into beta pylene, how fast is our beta pylene gonna leave us? It doesn't look like that fast as far as the chart here goes. So maybe we'll be fine to be able to wait until our foam comes up to the 1 million mark. That's the hope. I'm going to get a little little extra beta pylene above what we need. Maybe up to 10 million just to have a little extra buffer. But we are going to go into the void here. Grab all of our lovely reality. Alright, and we can reload these silos, come back up here, make some hollow fruits. Make one hollow, f <laughs> one hollow fruit. I think our next trip into the void will probably be able to gain enough reality to make two hollow fruits, hopefully. All right, nine point six six million. We're doing look looking good. Doing well. Oh, uh, grab this silo. Nine point eight five, and then it's yeah. So at ten, we're gonna cut off the the irradiators here. So I think they're our main source of celestial foam usage. At least I hope that's the case. If it's anything here in our factory floor, I don't I don't think it's a good idea to stop that. All right, move these out. And actually, you know what? We can just do this. Keep them running. And yeah, look at that. Once those irradiators stopped, we're not using celestial foam anymore. And over here, beta pylene. We get a, we get a large spike, but it's hopefully not so often that we can keep above 9.43 million that we need for the Hell Vault. I don't know if we're, I don't know if we're doing this fast enough. 2k a second? We gotta be faster. We need to get this to get down to Celestial Foam. All right, we're doing okay. It's gonna take it's gonna take a while, but we can just keep uh, monitoring things. Oh, going back to the void. 
Yep, this is all ready. Very nice. I didn't notice if the hollow fruits are increasing in price every time we make one. They seem around the same price. Come back down here. Go up. Oh, wait. Uh, load our silos. All right. Go back up to our hollow rock. And let's make uh, this fruit over here. So 32, 499, 998. It does increase. Oh, and we're just <laughs> 1,098 reality. We have 1,094. Just that close. Uh, Where well, we stopped over here. Why is this so slow right here in the middle? Whoa, what's going on here? Oh, wait a minute. Oh, no. Is it the chromolits? Oh, no, it's the chromolits. These, these guys use chromolits. I don't, I don't know which one uses chromolits, but I'm guessing something does and maybe we're not able to refuel it no we have plenty left i don't know why these are going so slow here okay it's back that was strange but we're good but we but we are gonna run out of chromolits look at our usage okay we're, we're halfway there uh how many chromolits do we need for the hell vault only 288 that's not too bad we're holding great on the beta piling maybe we need to manually run these just so our factory floor doesn't stop oh yeah look at that we're why are we stopped i don't know what's going on with this area right here in the middle what are we missing I have the injector here. Should inject to this block. I have the destabilizer here. Why is this destabilizer blinking in and out? These guys aren't doing it. What, what is going on with you? How come your usage is so, so fast? I mean, this one isn't doing it. It's something, something is odd with this here. Hold on. Uh, can we do this? Just reset you. Okay. Maybe it always does that. I I don't know. I, <laughs> I'm freaking out over nothing. Where are we at? We're at 700k celestial foam. Still got the beta piling. We're running fast out of chromolit. Let's run these again. I gotta get this hell vault. We gotta get two hell vaults actually. Uh, run them again. How are we looking over here? All the silos, good. They're all good. Uh, go back up to the void. I wonder if we put a... Can we build another chancel? I don't think we can. No, we can't. It's not there in the list anymore. I was going to say we could build another chancel 
up by the hollow rock. And then we can go into the void by the hollow rock, collect all of the reality there, then leave leave the void, use the waypoint, and then use the chancel here to grab the reality down here. But this chancel was up here at the top, so we can't build this again. We can only have one. All right, 800 celestial foam. Let's just run all four of these one more time. Oh, um, come up here. We can make some more fruits, can't we? Or well, we can make one more there. And then we can put a flower there. You can be a fruit. Uh, let's get rid of those. All right, back down. All right, almost there to the hell vault. I mean, I think that's our next step, right? The inverse chasm is definitely what we're gunning for. And we need to get two hell vaults here. So I think ap even after we get this hell vault, we need to save up enough to get another hell vault. Oh, here we go. Uh, zoom back in. Almost there. Uh, let's run these again so we don't run out of chromolits. And then I guess we... What else do we need here to do? Yeah, the two million is going to be rough. Because we're essentially going to have to do the same thing where we get all these other resources up. But then we hold off on things in order to get our celestial foam back. Unless, unless the point is just to make more factory floors, more, more excavators. Maybe we should have started this extractor here a lot sooner. Uh, who's that? Somebody went out. There we go, down here. 1.13. Okay, here we go. 1.17. Not the 1.17 we're looking for. There it is. And then now, holy cow, 3.5 million. You've got to be kidding me. How do we get up to that? There's got to be something I'm missing with celestial foam creation. Okay, uh, let's move these back here. Grab all this, um, and we don't have we don't have a conversion machine that makes celestial foam. We just have ones that destroy <laughs> celestial foam. We fuse chromolits and celestial foam to make beta pyrene. We irradiate celestial foam with a chromolit, converting the foam into chromolits. It's all stuff that gets rid of celestial foam. Nothing that generates it. So I think the only way we're generating it, right, is through our extracting channels here. 
and we're using way too much over here. Maybe we... Let's do this. And take a look if two, two of these is enough to continually, continually be positive in chromolits. And maybe then we can be positive in celestial foam. Maybe running four of them is too much. Uh, but let's run these. Let's get our Karenite up. And let's also go to the void. And we gotta feed our portal here. It's too small. But the hollow stone or the hollow rocks, hollow fruits should do that just fine. There we go. Alright, uh, reload. I heard some silos go out there. Come back up here. Make... Oh no, we can't make anything. Oh, we have enough hollow fruit maybe that it's eating everything now? Interesting. Can we... Oh, grab this. Can we destroy these things? It looks like we can. We might want to destroy some of these fruits, even destroy all of them, get tons of hollow stones and so we can build flowers all over them. Then again, that might not matter because even if we have even more hollow fruits, it's not going to be generating enough hollow stones to feed all those hollow fruits. So it might just be fine where, where it's at right now. Alright, I wasn't paying attention to where we were with chromolits. I think we were above this. We were like 27 or something. So we're at 22 and 80. And what we want is both of these numbers to go up. And find that balance. I mean, it doesn't look... Or plus 22, minus 17. It goes up to plus 22 there. Chromolits, plus 530, minus 417. I mean, I think it is going up. But the issue is... <laughs> how long does this all have to run? In order to get <laughs> to the 2 million of Celestial Foam. Or not 2 million. We're talking about the Hell Vault. That's right. The 3 million... 3.5 million and the 28 million beta piling. It's going to take way too long. We're already at 15,000. No sign of celestial foam here yet. We're in the beta piling phase. So I think me I think I need to get another extractor going right here. So then we can have four extractors grabbing celestial foam out of the ground. All right, but we're at over an hour, so that's going to do it for this video. We have a plan, though. I mean, the plan right now is just Hell Vault into Inverse Challenge, and then we can presumably go to the Unknown. It is a bridge to the Unknown at this point. Uh, with all the crazy stuff that's been going on, I'm not even scared about it. <laughs> let's go. Let's do it. Head into the unknown. Uh, yeah, 2895. Oh, that's pretty nice. These Just running two of these. We go up very slowly in Chromalit, but we're going up a fair bit faster in Celestial Foam. So having two seems like the better option right now. Uh, but that's all going to have to be for next time. Trying to get another Hell Vault. Get the Inverse Chasm. Once again, this has been 64. If you enjoyed the video, be sure to like and subscribe. And if you made it this far, thanks for watching.